We all know that we should be eating more fruits and vegetables and exercising, but do we really have any idea how big an impact this healthy lifestyle will have? Hi, I'm Rebecca Brayton and welcome to WatchMojo.com. And today we're speaking with Dr. Richard Beliveau to learn the secrets of eating well and living well. Now the book is called An Everyday Guide to Optimum Health. What does that entail briefly? We can prevent about 80% of chronic diseases. Simple change in lifestyle. Quit smoking, healthy body weight, major portions of fruits and vegetables, seven to 10 a day, regular exercise, 30 minutes a day, and staying away from junk food and industrially transformed product will reduce type two diabetes by 92%, heart disease by 80%, stroke and cancer by 70%. We become sick at about 50 years old in modern societies, while our life expectancy is about 78 to 82, depending on the countries. That's 25, 30 years that we are very sick, taking medication, getting surgery and so on. We can displace the age at which we become sick just by simple change. Eat like the Mediterranean people are eating, the Spanish, the Portuguese, the Italian. Hundreds of millions of people are eating right every day, the Thai, the Chinese, the Japanese. A good example of simple change you can do to improve your quality of your life is replacing the fat you're using with olive oil. In all studies, olive oil is the essence of what we call the Mediterranean diet. 40% of what the Greek, the Italian are eating as part of their diet comes from olive oil. Make tasting of olive oil a pleasure. Now, cancer is obviously something that is on everyone's mind. Is there anything we can specifically do to target cancer? Last year was published the biggest report ever written on prevention of cancer. It was written by the World Cancer Research Fund. They emitted 10 recommendations. What was the first one? Be as lean as possible with a body mass index between 21 and 23. Exactly what we've put in the book. These are the same recommendations. Listen to the big health organization, the World Health Organization, the World Cancer Research Fund. These are the recommendations you should follow. But we prefer to think about pill, supplements and things like that. Supplement. One of the recommendations is do not use supplements to prevent cancer. Eat this, not supplements. Supplements validate in North American people their bad eating habits. Thank you so much. Thank you, it was a pleasure.